I'm Maxwell Pettit. My name is Daphna Margulit. My name is Noah Sadi. I am the team lead for our team Grid vs. Evil. Grid vs. Evil. Grid vs. Evil, and we're working on the project Electric Vehicle Ecosystem Exhibit. So it's an interactive exhibit uh, designed to educate people on a modern electrical grid and how we can revolutionize the way we transfer energy. It's going to be a small model with a autonomous driving vehicle and the idea is that the vehicle along with the houses and the buildings in the model demonstrate what a future electric grid could look like. So it's kind of like everything's like a mutually beneficial relationship with everything in the environment. Our electric grids today have a lot of points of failure. You know we saw in Texas like major catastrophes what happens when the power goes down and our electric grids fail. The big challenge of our project is revolutionizing the electrical grid in the way that we power entire cities and uh, a way that that can be done is by you know, storing reserve power and having it available when there are outages. Using renewable energy, we have the opportunity and the ability to you know, transfer energy, say, from a car to a home, from a home to a car. I feel like just like growing up as a kid or like anyone really always has this idea of like, oh, I'm going to change the world and I want to be a part of something big. And I think Mission Zero is definitely a part or a chance for anyone to do that. The main reason I became an engineer and why all of us became engineers and wanted to be engineers is because we wanted to change the world in some way and have an impact and leave a lasting mark. Climate change and the environment is a very big uh, pressing issue nowadays and you know something has to be done about it. The technology exists like if we wanted to fix climate change and there was no um, barriers with implementation or po politics or anything then we could do it. Autonomous electric vehicles are going to be a part of our future, not if, but when. It's more than just reusable bags. It's more than just you know biking or walking to work. All great things that we should be doing, but it's such a small scale for the individual. This is a problem that anyone and everyone can help with, and we could use anyone and everyone's help. This is our future. This is this is our planet. This is our world. You know, um, we can really change how we view power and how we view power usage in our cities, our homes, our cars, and. Renewable energy is the way to do that.